Hello, active hope, or active trust. It could be the title of the gospel of today because people who are searching help in this gospel of today are desperately doing that. They, let's, see, let's say the woman of the gospel, starting with her, she is ill, but she's ill for so long time. And she's not discouraged. She's searching so many ways for healing, and she's ready for suffering for that because he, she knows that the cures of the doctors in these times weren't were all were were connected with great pain, as the gospel is revealing, and they are costly. There was no national insurance, so she instead of sitting and expecting okay maybe expecting maybe there will be some help i don't do anything about that no instead of that she's searching actively she's risking she's risking being uh, being that somebody will um, will say her tell her some bad words because she's um she's leaving the area which was for her as a impure woman with blood she was not allowed to touch other people other persons so this is one thing and the father the father makes a lot for her child this is a child feminine child child in the culture, I think there was much less done for the children as we know it from our times. And especially, maybe women were not so uh, so privileged as we have this in our times. And the father is searching this help so dramatically. So even risking contacting Jesus, maybe he was an important feature, but not only. He was a feature which is a person who may cause for him problems because it's, it was not uh, somebody who hasn't already some heavy discourses with Pharisee and other respectable persons. So they are not letting things go as they are and so I think that this kind of active faith, of active trust, is what moved Jesus so much. And I think we can learn from this gospel that if we encounter such great problems in our life, we don't have to just sit down and do oh, I will maybe there will be help, maybe no, and I'm disparated. But I am not doing anything. I think this is saying us search for healing. Thank you.